Tyler McGee here at Orange County National. Just wanted to review Rory's iron swing, okay? So when he's coming into the ball, you'll see Rory probably more than most guys. He'll hit this sort of cut off, um, you know, may, actually Fleetwood does it a bit, but you think of Rory, especially this weekend, he was hitting a ton of these sort of hold off looking iron shots that would sort of go up and they'd have a very small amount of draw, okay? So that's, I would say, Rory is more known for hitting a little right to left shot than a left to right shot. I've seen him hit some cuts, but I think his DNA sort of suits more of that little bit of a draw, okay? So for him, what is he doing to get the club to deliver into a good spot, but then also you don't see him really rolling his hands a lot when he's hitting this draw. So if I'm in here and I'm gonna use the track man, so when the club is traveling down, for the club, for the ball to draw, we need the, typically if you want it starting right and drawing, the pass gonna be to the right, so meaning traveling sort of down and from the inside with a slightly open face. So say if I'm using numbers, if the path is say three degrees into out, with the face one degree open, the ball is going to start a little bit right and then sort of work back uh, to the target. Maybe even two degrees open, it's going to start a little more right and then work back to the target. Okay, so that's sort of what I'm trying to have happen. When the club is traveling down, that movement down is also going to help me get the path more to the right. Okay, so when I'm hitting uh, a tee shot and the club is traveling up, I need my swing direction or my swing more to the right for me to hit that same draw shot. With an iron, since it's on the ground, I can be really swinging. It can look very neutral, like right down on top of the ball, but if I have enough attack angle, that is gonna shift the path to the right, and then have the face a little open, and start right, come back, okay? So if I'm in there, and I'm gonna do Rory's iron swing, so one thing he's that I really like that he does is when he takes it back, Okay, he still does that same shift, but then as he's coming through, you can see him really controlling how much the face is moving. And for him, since the path is typically to the right anyways, he's not working. You don't see him working like this to try to draw it. He goes a little bit here, and then from there, it's straight rotation and this nice cutoff finish. So if I get in there, I'm going to aim relatively neutral ball just ever so slightly back and then i'm going to work into that three-quarter finish similar to rory with that little bit of lateral shift but then also really rotating hard through the shot so i'm trying i'm doing my best to sort of hit that draw rory type shot and that one actually went up with a little bit of draw the club numbers there were Oh, it missed it. It was too good, it missed it. Let me try one more here. If I can copy that one, I'll be thrilled. Good, so, and that's, you know, that's that three quarter shot that I'm trying to hit. So club path is uh, six into out, so that's a fair amount of draw, so I could probably neutralize that slightly. But if, you, if you're if you a person that's struggling with getting it to draw, a little bit of that sort of shift to the left as you're opening up is gonna help you keep that sweet spot in here. The key though, is when you do it, you gotta make sure you keep rotating. If you shift and you don't rotate, you're gonna be in trouble, you're gonna hit some big pushes. So give that a try, see if that helps you out.